Okay guys, today I am reviewing this KCEVE 3x3 keyboard video mouse switch. What does it mean by 3, 3x3? It means it supports three computers and three monitors. There, that's my old one, my old KCEVE 2x2 switch. You know, these days, got to work three times as hard in this economy. So I'm upgrading to three monitors and upgrading to this. Let's see the size. Well, it's uh, significantly larger, which reflects the additional profile, additional monitor and additional computer it supports. It has a on and off button now. Now you can specify which one, instead of pressing that one button to toggle, you can actually specify which one you want to jump to. It has a port for wire remote. You can hide this under the desk and just have the wire remote on your desk. If you're a neat guy, like uh, unlike me, for me, look at my cable management, I'm pretty terrible at that. Usually I'm not, I'm not a fan, I'm not a, expert in hiding these under the desk but if you, if you are very good very handy wired remote here okay so it has an hdmi with two display port per computer it does come with the usb usb 3.0 cables it does not come with hdmi and display port cables so you would need to supply your own cables, okay? So how many you need? You would need uh, four sets of HDMI, eight sets of DisplayPort cables in order to use this. It also has a 12 volt adapter, okay, 12 volt adapter. From my previous experience with these kind of KVM switches, you do not need this unless you run heavy load on these USB ports. If you just if you just want to plug in a mouse or a keyboard, chances are this is unnecessary. But we will see with this. We will see whether it's necessary or not. This is just to provide additional voltage, additional power, okay, in case additional power in case the power supplied by the laptops are not enough okay here are the supplied usb 3.0 cables and the remote all right i've wired everything up i have three docking stations wired to this Cable is still a mess, but with enough time and zip ties, I think those would look prettier. Three docking stations, a Targus with, uh, with Thunderbolt MSC technology, a Dell WD-19 with, again, Thunderbolt w um, MSC technology, and a Dell D6000 with Display Link. Now, Display Link is slightly different than Thunderbolt. What it does is it's essentially it essentially uh, contains exterior display adapters inside this. So MacBook, I have Intel MacBook here and Chromebook. Those would be able to use Display Link to connect to uh, more than one computer. With Thunderbolt, these two, uh, if you connect to an Intel MacBook or any MacBook for that matter. Uh, you might only be able to, uh, the three monitors might only be able to act as one uh, that mirror each other, okay? Same with Chromebook. Uh, with uh, this uh, Windows laptop, this one supports both. So now number one is linked to the Windows laptop. I'm going to switch to number two, okay? This is a Intel MacBook that's connected to the display link docking station. And with the correct driver installed, with the most up-to-date driver installed, you can see all three screens work and they work as separate screens. 
So you can you can have this screen as well. So in total four screens. I'm testing four screens. They work uh, pretty well. Press the number three. It's going to li link to the Chromebook. But this Chromebook is connected to the Thunderbolt MST docking station, which it doesn't support that well. So now these three monitors, they will work as uh, they will mirror each other. I did try to connect the Chromebook to the display link. Somehow, Chromebook, with the driver that it has, only supports two exterior monitors with display link. So I don't know whether in the future, when it updates the driver, it will be able to support three. Right now, it only supports two, two exterior monitors acting as separate monitors. I was able to, however, uh, use the third monitor by connecting the third monitor uh, to the second USB-C cable. I have a USB-C to HDMI cable. Using that one, I was able to use the third monitor. Switching back to Windows. As I predicted before, you do not need the adapter. You do not, do not need the 12 volt adapter. This works, this is not connected to the, to the power adapter, it works just fine. You probably do need it if you connect some heavy duty load into these USB ports. Okay, now it's Windows, switching to Mac. Does take a little bit of time, okay. Make sure you own. Make sure you install the latest Display Link driver. Otherwise, it might only work with two exterior monitors. You might need a, the newer one to work with more than two. Chromebook. So far, it's been rock solid. Connected to the webcam. Connected to the mouse. Doesn't need the exterior power adapter. All right, take it easy, guys.